Hi everyone, Brett Wilson with Digital Doc. Wanted to take just a couple of minutes and go through the installation of our Loom carries detection technology and also show you how it works with our intro camera. So let's start by just going to digi-doc.com, our website here, choose products, carries detection, simply scroll down, click details, and then your installer. So once you run the installer, what you're going to see there's a couple of quick clicks that go next, 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 yes, install. And what you're looking for down in the bottom tray here is this colored wheel. Okay, so it is now in color, the colored wheel. When we double click it for the loom, it'll go to black and white. I'll show you that in just a second. So when we have our image screen up, we're going to take the loom device. Okay, so with the loom device, you simply just attach it to the top of the existing Iris 2.0. What you want to do is turn your light off on the camera, make sure the camera is set at the one setting, and then simply touch the button on the back here, and that'll turn on your light. Okay, so this is going to hug the tooth, simply shine light, transillumination through the tooth. And when I capture that image, I'm going to show you first in color what this is going to look like. Okay, so I'm on that one setting. Coming back up, I'm gonna turn the light off on the camera. With the loom light on, I'm going to go back to my tray. Remember the colored wheel? Change that to black and white. Now you're ready to capture with the loom device. Simply use the button on your Iris 2.0 camera to capture the image. Now I'll show you what it looks like when you see decay in a tooth. Okay, so here are the images that I just took. I don't have caries in this particular tooth or it would show up dark, but where you will see caries, in this example here, it looks like this. So you notice how this turns dark. In a proximal decay, you can really identify with the loom technology. It's very easy to use. The tip, you can take the tip off, autoclavable, okay? You can autoclave this tip, comes with three different tips with the device. There's a great product from GC called Co-Effect. So if you choose, pull the device off, spray it all down, spray the tip down. If you choose not to autoclave, which you certainly can as many times as you would like, put the tip back on and the device simply goes right on top of your existing Iris 2.0 camera. Now, this will work in all 40 different software programs that the camera works in existing. And the install is that simple. Couple of clicks, double click your wheel, and there you have it. 